<laughs> That's him. Man, it feels like I'm back in 2016, 2015. I think someone 20... joined was about one of the years. years. Just you know, I used to make a lot of mod videos. It feels good being back in them. You know, it really does. Doesn't so guys, hey, let me know how you guys feel about them. Okay, hey, lady, how do you feel? You don't know? Me neither. I appreciate your input though. Thank you. <laughs> I'm insane. Well, you know what else is insane? This mod that we're checking out. Uh oh, oh! I thought my game just crashed. That would have been awkward. It's uh, it's a Thanos mod. Uh, I'm excited. Prompt. I really want to try this. All right, yeah, so here we are. Look. We're we're Thanks Thanos. For that, or Barney, the, the big uh, green Titan that has an infinity. Green. It's purple, you dumbass. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Go slow motion. Look at that. Turn your mic off and so wrap good. it. You're His, echoing. Uh, you know that awkward moment when your on? arms are too long yeah. and your hands go go through your thighs? I hate when that happens. But uh, to fix that, what was that? What? Are those shoes? The shoes up there. What? what? One of the buttons okay, lets hold on a second. Let me click car. down my mouse button again. What was that? Jesus. Okay, so he's he's Bumblebee. he's Thanos yes, the car Bumblebee. the car dealer. Is that what's Thanos going on here? I can just Bumblebee. hey, I got this great new Volkswagen Beetle Dune buggy here for you. You don't like that one? Hold on. I got Is this the fan? Well, I'm kidding. Yeah. It's Infinity War 2. This is Infinity War 2. Come on, kid, pick me. I breathe fire. That's a lie. He only knows Scratch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, kid. Check out what I can do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, that was good. Like on this awesome superhero classic Jesus. The Flash is very. Why is Flash? He thinks he's so cool with his Batman. superpowers. No, it's Batgirl. My gadget no, could be Batman. him any day. No, look. Hair bun. Why? You know what? It's Stephanie with his Brown. Classic hair bun. Hey, Speedy, go look. It's black. Oh, hey, Batman. Uh, uh, my name is not Batman. You want to race? Are you serious? Super, super, duper serious. I've seen okay. this before. It sucks. Batman's gonna race the Flash. He's so yeah, sweet. that makes Turn sense. Up, Check this out. Killwick is John oh, dead. Serious. The battle is about to begin. Who said that? What the? Where are my clothes? Why would you care, Harley? Well, I hope you got a good float knife, old buddy, because you ain't seen this chemical bleach booty again. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> my uniform has a lot of accessories. With, uh, it's a club posse, huh? <laughs> yeah, what's your problem? This guy's voice is awful. Who said that? What the? Where are my clothes? Put on your uniform and enter the arena. Well, I hope you got a good float knife, old buddy, because you ain't seen this chemical Double team Thanos and Lucky. It's Lucky. Loki, oh, my bad. My Top uniform has a lot of accessories. Um, I don't actually want to be what the list to get posted. Us? What? Mission begins in 60 I don't want seconds. this to be posted, man. Tonight. <laughs> Big mug of my foot up your ass. We That's have you surrounded, mission. at least from this time. You know what? Put his mug up his oh, ass. Yeah. Come on out. Why did he leave? <laughs> This is bad, whatever this is. I didn't even look at the. I didn't even look at the. I actually kind of hate the fact that this is actually the one. Mission begins in 10 seconds. Five, four, three. Or two million subscribers. We did it! Two million subscribers! Woo! 
Okay, we have six million subscribers. So good job, yeah. boys. Two million subscribers. But we had an agreement. So Chris, it's time to hold up your end of the bargain. Oh, are you serious? Do I have to? Don't worry, Chris. It's gonna be fun. I promise. And guys, afterwards, I have presents for all of us to open for hitting two million subscribers. So let's go. Guys, guys, that's it. It's nice. over. He died. He did. Did the dead. Good stuff. Alright. I really hope that uh, Nick joins. Nick Fury. He comes yeah. in and says, Robo Buddies, you're a part of something much bigger. <laughs> You said Nick Fury. <laughs> I know. I don't know. It's not like we can watch any of her. Or Nick videos. Yeah, we could watch some of her streams. We could watch the one where she calls me out for being edgy. <laughs> what the hell is this? Now hand over that chow, nice That's and easy. That's bad. Look at that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Wait. Aww. The intro is like so now ten hand seconds long. Look at that. <laughs> so it's really just a twenty. Public enemy number one. So That's <laughs> me. Oh. You may be wondering <laughs> why uh, Sonic is running away from the police in the twenty nineteen movie. <laughs> The fucking menace. It's a fucking tap dancing menace. He's a menace. Oh, public traffic. enemy number one. Sonic, Jesus Christ. People need to get home. <laughs> Come on, Sonic. I must dance. <laughs> People have jobs. I would have wanted to say that if it wasn't for the sucks. fact that it was copyrighted. This sucks. Let's see their art stream. This is boring. All of the beginning of her stream. <laughs> All of her streams are boring. This mini Yeah, doesn't she do them like every other Friday or something? Well, if that was the case, it would actually be way more. That's true. She's been here for a good while. She's been on the earth. Ready to Freddy? I wouldn't doubt that. Um, I'm not ready to Freddy got fingered, but I am ready to record this. I feel right. almost kind of bad to say that with all this content. Yeah. Uh, what else is this? What is this? Is this another thing? It's not. This isn't her singing. This is a movie that she likes. Is this another weirdo thing? Or... Oh, yeah. This was oh, like a it's, it's actually animated shit. Contrary to popular belief, I don't hate everything. There's quite a few that things that I like. Sick, I like Ninja Girls Turtles. Really I like motor. I don't think you have a reputation for hating everything, Rovo. Actually, she, according to her comment section, and I talk about her. But, Robo, you hate everything. She hates me. City, oh, she I like hates Paradise, me. and yeah, I also I like well, Help, I'm a maybe. Fish. Does she at least talk to you? Uh, well, she hates me more now, let's just say that. While not at all oh, perfect, now, this yeah. is still a nice, Probably. charming little kid's movie that doesn't really do anything wrong. The worst thing about it is the fact that it didn't do very well and didn't even receive a theatrical release in America. Which is a shame. Damn, this is the sort of movie I would have loved as a kid. I can totally see <laughs> little baby Robo watching this movie alongside Space Jam and We're Back a Dinosaur Story. But that's enough preamble. Let's get into exactly what makes this film tick. Oh my... That was bad audio mixing. <laughs> she... <laughs> 
the video interrupted her. I don't think I've actually. It's literally made just a... an animated remake of a fish called Wanda. Yes, yeah, sorry, no thanks. I have a theory about little buddy actually going to recent uh Every time I scroll through Robo Buddy's videos, I just get bored. It's like nauseatingly boring. <laughs> Please find these kind of I, you know the channels were their earlier shit got views, but their current they're still small. Well, Sonic? Yeah. Weird. What's he gonna do? It's been Alright. Sucks. Just gonna do that for every time. <laughs> Is her uh animation? Yeah, I probably should. It is loud. That is loud as hell. Uh, mm, 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 mm. I, I'm actually starting to think that RoboBuddy's actually yeah, watched uh, a single one of her videos. She used that in one of the vid- These are the things from the Steven Universe yeah, video. Why is she showing them again? She's showing all the sketch phase. Showing how everything looks in the sketch. You'll see how it looks in the. It's <laughs> funny. Oh, I'm a Tumblr character. Oh, I'm super. Uh, simple. Yeah. Is this Pac-Man? Oh, is there audio that goes with this? Or is it just No, it's just all music. All music. Pac-Man took my thingy. My chair. I broke my wrist. Is he that a man over wait, there? I'm going to kill the him. Didn't she? Looks like it. I don't remember looking that smooth. What the hell is this music? It sounds like he's screeching. Why is it the 14th worst Danny Phantom episode? Why not just the worst? Well, the 14th. I think that's supposed to mean the 14th. I don't get it. No. I don't Do get it either. Yeah. Why the 14th worst Danny Phantom episode? So she says it's the worst. Is this okay, so before then? I get into the actual video, something I wanted to bring before up. Before I get into I, the actual video. I ordered the DVD for the footage <laughs> for this episode, and for some reason on Amazon, the third season of Danny Phantom isn't listed as Danny Phantom Season 3. It's listed as Danny Phantom The Final Season. Why would you do that? Why would you not number it like a normal human being with basic cognitive reasoning? Quick addendum. But it was the I final was wrong. season. Reality Trip is on the Season 2 DVDs, which I already have. I bought this garbage season for nothing. God damn it. She's a robot. No. <laughs> I don't care. I don't... <laughs> Let's see the reviews. I think you're being more of a dick than I am. <laughs> Sing along if you're Sonic Red. Like Robo. Everyone choose to make reviews. That was weird. Alright, let's watch this. Okay, so before I get into Just the actual video, the something. Room. It's. Reasoning. Quick. Or nothing. Danny Phantom was a show. You might even say it was good a good one. show. 
Airing on Nickelodeon in 2004, Danny Phantom was a show about a boy with ghost powers who had to armor. fight other ghosts. Helping him are his friends Tucker, the techno geek, polished armor, and Sam. It wasn't a ghost, but they're so mainstream now. Oh, shut up. There's also Danny's sister, Jazz, who's really studious and is also the best character. Fight me. It was pretty red. Unfortunately, there were some aspects of the show that were noticeably less she red. The mic. In Did particular, you hear that when season she said three, Anne is also the best character. Fight me. It was pretty red. Unfortunately, there were some aspects of the show that were noticeably yeah. She said some, and it clipped the mic when less red. In particular, season three is infamous among fans for being really, 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 like, really, like, really bad. Like, oh my god, like, how did this have happened? How does, how does the film just mean? Like, oh my god, it's so bad, you guys. It's, it's so bad. And what better way to kick off a terrible season than with That's a terrible sad. special? Reality Trip was a summer vacation special that was used to end season two. I suppose it's somewhat fitting since you can assume various summer activities yeah. are taking place over the season they break, the but comments. the concept of a summer vacation special is still really weird to me, especially since summer vacation doesn't start at the same time for everyone. So while for some it was a fun way to start the summer, for others it was just a brutal reminder of how much fun everyone else was having while your district is entering the hell that is finals. So the episode opens and Danny is late for the end of Okay, uh, this sucks, okay. Cool. <laughs> you, ghost kid, I get my hands on you, I'll tear you apart, molecule by molecule! Who the hell keeps a window in their shower? Which is a perfect example of why I won't be going ghost during my Fenton family vacation. This is the thing that I'm doing. Is that what this his voice is... sounds like? Who? What? Danny Phantoms. He has an obnoxious yeah. voice. I wouldn't watch this show. I watched the time that it is. Why let this be brought up naturally in a conversation when I can just narrate to myself? So Danny flies to school and why is the sun still in the frame if the camera is moving away? What? <laughs> Rabbit fight, up though, naturally in a conversation when I can just narrate to myself. So Danny flies to school and why is the sun still in the frame if the camera is moving away? Oh, I think she genuinely, there was a skip there. I don't think that was Rabbit. Huh. Oh yeah. I hope you've been enjoying your stay with us, Freak Show. God damn it, why is Freak Show in this special? Why is Freak Show in the season 2 finale? Of all the villains we have in this show, even the freaking box ghost would have been better than goddamn Freak Show in his stupid face. You will always have to yeah, fuck up I everything, don't you? So they're trying to interrogate him on this magical thing called the Reality Gauntlet. Don't worry about them explaining it because nothing will. The Reality Gauntlet? That's literally just the Infinity Gauntlet. It's the same thing. Just with fewer stones. Oh, yeah. Fuck. Stuff just, happens, and, it, and, and they just let Freak Show out, because reality. why the hell- Instead of the Infinity Gauntlet, which manipulates space, time, mind, reality, soul, and, uh, power. This one can only manipulate reality. I so think it's, reality is basically all you need. Reality really is all you need, but... I mean, like, time's, time's just, pretty cool, too. Yeah. Although, he needed all of them to wipe out half the universe but time well, it's pretty yeah. he needed time so that he could get the mind stone and the well, mind yeah, stone's but pretty if he, did, he could people. literally just warp reality to the point where he can at the point of the movie well not and surprise shit gets fucked but the gauntlet is useless without its power source <laughs> Which I just so happen to have right here! Freeze it, freak! Why did they not pat him down before interrogating him? Do these government agents have no protocol whatsoever? Okay, so I'm editing this in. Or, like, I found this while I was I editing, but... Okay, so... This video is... It's weird. It's, it's like, chaotic. There's, like, that song playing in the background the whole time. It's, yeah. It feels like she's going insane. 
they walk out of the school, right? And it's all like, oh, they're cheering, there's a concert directly outside of the school, right? Right? So first of all, so you see them burst out and they run, and then it immediately cuts to them next to the concert. So it's easy to assume that the concert is directly outside Actually, of what school, school has a, right? Have a sidewalk but then, the so Danny, Sam, and uh, and Tucker walk out, and then they walk by a fence, no school in sight, no concert in sight, just out of nowhere, and they walk on the sidewalk for a bit, clearly, clearly passing several trees and walking there, and then, look, when it cuts to this shot, even though they're on a sidewalk and the the dirt is colored that greenish color, then when it gets to this scene, suddenly they're I walking on I grass because that's the same co they're not walking on the grass, color that's a... no, as, the, as the green in the grass. Big so with, uh, the video. it's it has to do with their talking screen. Yeah. Aware that this is a. Uh, it sounds like she's trying to keep up with the song. That's Suddenly they're on a side- I'm telling you, this song throws off- the song choice throws off the whole video. I'd walk, yeah. and then- and then they're on grass, and now- and now they're at this, so you can assume, okay, so they must have walked me, like, off of the sidewalk onto this grass, right? Right? But then, okay, so Jazz bumps into him, and now, look! They're right outside of the school again! Our main characters are walking along, talking about summer again, That's which weird. means we didn't need that earlier dialogue at all, and how excited they are for a concert that's happening right next to the school, because that's a thing that happens, and how excited they are for a big old cross-country road trip across the world. Yeah. Actually, across the country, like, which is why it's called cross-country. I want to go there. I don't think there's a road around the world. In fact, did you know? God, Danny, why you gotta be such a dick? No, no books. This is summer. We don't read for fun. Ghost attack happens, and there's a fight scene, and it's really tame because it's 2004. And nothing really happens. It's just like Freak Show's like, hey, okay, let's, hi. Let's and Danny's like, oh question. shit. And then uh, they fight for. Uh. I haven't been keeping track of what what start talking about the story. Yeah, we're like halfway through the video and she's not even like talking. Pretty, like she did touch base on it a little bit, but barely. I feel like she with a lot of you know, things that don't matter. To her. Yeah, uh, they're animation okay. errors though, so that's well, kind yeah, of yeah, animation. Did rag on it a bit. Yeah, she kind of did. <laughs> it's the weird For a bit. one. And the guys in white are like, yo! The way, the and shows like, like, no! And then the, the there's the ice. And then. Uh, huh? Uh. Uh. This was, uh May 3rd, 2016, at 3.35. Uh, okay, PM. I think she might. Yeah, probably. Everyone is all of the time, even before then. That's how the algorithms always well, worked. Yeah, I'm pretty this sure. was before the algorithm wow. added, like, the... <sighs> well, also, the 10-minute um, thing was in place since, like, 2010, I think. Or 2009. And there's robots in... The the I thought that drink at the Bane face. Why is this bad? I think it's because it's a bad. Even though this is like really obviously like a problem, and Danny's all like, now let the dorksicles handle it. And even though, even though the guys in white are like really clearly like I incapacitated, like dude. That, that they 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 ain't gonna do shit. What makes you think that they 
Well, what is wrong with you? You're dumb. So they go to a concert in reality gauntlet consists of four gems, which guys, come on. Wait, if there is a book that has all the information on the reality gauntlet, then why the guys might need to interrogate Freak Show? It'd be one thing if it was like a limited amount of information, but like, but Sam reads like, like three chapters of this and suddenly she like knows everything about it. Reality gauntlet consists of four gems. Freak show. As long as we're touching the gauntlet, we have just as much control as you do. Quick, according to the book, the gauntlet has a defense mechanism. Think of a place to hide the gem you're holding, holding which according to Freak Show's yeah, book are activated by touch. And another ghost fight! It's all so really tame. And Sam and Tucker are being restricted by Ghost Lady. How will they get out of this? Yeah. Oh. That, that was easy. So the three That's of them grab the gauntlet um, and holy shit, it's huge! That's because um, Butch Hartman's a weirdo. Actually, with this one, he said that he wanted to... Yeah, so isn't he like a big old like Christian now? Oh, yeah, he has these Christian. like... And he has these like dominatrix ghosts in his by the time cartoons. He, uh, by the time he made this movie, he wanted to put more of his I couldn't even tell his face. Got me. Uh, but basically, <laughs> having Danny as a ghost was just a little bit too much. How? They have the the Phantom Zone is in, a thing in Danny Phantom, which is supposed is just like an afterlife, but it's not like a Christian afterlife. So like, how is it? Isn't I, that contradictory to, to the? He was trying to be. At that time, we couldn't really. It was a time where, uh, you know, Christianity was starting to fall out of whatever that means. That basically means the Christian is probably not going to be. So they're holding on to the gauntlet, and Sam's all like, "Okay, guys, as long as we're touching this, we have as much control over reality." Too close. It's cartoons. Freak Show does, and the, we gotta send the gems away so that so that Freak Show can't use the gauntlet. It's the only way. This is all we can do. Is that's the only way. To it's the only way, you ugly, fat-smelling fathead. But that's wrong, and. That is not what I thought he was going to say. Also stupid. Why do you have to send the gems away? You say you have control over the gauntlet, so why not make it so that the gauntlet doesn't work? Why not make it so that Freak Mark Show's a good exist. guy? Why not make it so that the gauntlet doesn't or never existed? Why not do anything except just momentarily? Why not? Why not wipe out half of all life in the? Terribly disabling him. Does he gotta do that? Is this really a thing you gotta do? If it is, if it really is a thing that you have to do, why do you have to like send them to like oh the Comic Con in uh, Florida and whatnot? Why, why not send it to like the center that? of the Earth? Why not send it to the Sun? Also, once the first gem is sent away, the gauntlet should be rendered useless and thus can't send away the other gems. Yeah, that's actually a point. Secret identity got revealed in every. Oh, shit, uh, wait. How is Freak Show, a regular human, fine from falling for that distance? But Danny, a ghost superpower guy, suddenly all that freaked ghost. up. Holy How is Freak Show, like... a regular human, fine from falling for that distance? But Danny, a ghost super. A ghost. Superpower guy suddenly all freaked Echo out. Echo superpower Holy guy. sweat socks! Danny Fan Turd is Danny Fan Turd, and he's totally infatuated with me. This makes things so much easier for me. Dang, Paulina's got her priorities straight. But then the guys in white show up again, 
And it's like, oh shit, what is a way that we could get away? We could just run into the crowd and like hide and it would be really hard for them to find us. But no, let's mosh pit away. Let's let's have the, cr let's crowd surf there. That makes sense. They have jetpacks, but we have a crowd to surf on. There's no way they'll catch up. So they're, they're running away and they're escaping. And the, the guys from high school, they're all like, Dude, you helped us, so now we'll help you. Mm, Paulina Fenton. Hey, I finally wrapped my mind around it. Paulina really needs to calm that thirst. Jesus Christ. They decide to head to Danny's house, not knowing that their parents... Yeah. ...have all been captured, as well as not seeming to consider that the guys in white might be there, which they are. Why is everyone being so dumb? But it's okay, because behind this random curtain that's on the wall for some reason is the home security system! How come he can't be a phantom again? Uh... Hmm. What's going on? The house attacks anything using ecto energy. I'm going ghost! Oh, I, okay, yeah, never mind. What the fuck did you think was gonna happen? So, like, I haven't brought this up yet, but Danny's powers are supposed to be, like, all shy, but they still, like, they escape, and Danny's still able to camo the whole ship, even though they've mentioned, oh no, my powers are messed up. The reality gauntlet explosion must have messed with my ghost powers. But, oh no, Freak Show is a pet dude. You need to brush your teeth, man. Uh, anyway, so so he has the parents, and and that's a bad situation for hey, everyone hey. involved. What? So now they have Join to the head rabbit. out to find the gems to save recording? their family. What? We're not recording. Which means they're safe and sound the and got the pulse. No, okay. Except I was What's thinking about the comic book convention. Are you recording? And I was no, we're thinking not about recording. the space center. And I was thinking anything. about paradise. Join the rabbit. Uh, I guess have any bearing on anything i just i i, I really i really like paradise first they have to head to the space center where the gem is hidden right on the floor nice hiding place but the gem makes the rocket ship come to life except if the gems were able to do these things in the first place then why were they useless to the guys in white hey look some wait let's make a quick comparison audio now audio audio now well they have to watch the video this is her old is it hey hey phase through Phase through the up. There you go. Okay, we're good. More well, shit happens, and I don't care. Why did she point that out if he does it anyways? Why? Why do you care? Yeah. And now it's time it for long. Operation Mega Escape Four. Go flew in and phase through instead of just climb on top of it. Phase part of his body. Why is it playing Jewish music? Everyone, get your bar mitzvahs ready. Sure We've lost visual. Again! Don't worry, they won't Boy. get far. We've got sensors everywhere. Yeah, you do. This is Viacom, man. I'll be lucky if this thing doesn't get taken down in the first hour. Next, they it go to Nevada, where all the guff people's been turned into bears. Destroy them, no. Danny! Find the gem that did this and rip the stuffing out of every single one of them! And then more stuff happen. happens. No, I don't the care. Real people, I just don't so care. Rough. They got the third gem. Whatever. Check out this cat. Gonna move Sticking to the, the microwave mall. like Plank it. Live by the pool. Gonna talk to Roxanne and not feel like a fool. Cause after cat? today, I'm gonna yeah, cat's be like cruising. 500 pounds. After today, okay. she'll it's be like mine. They get the it's like show. Garfield, but not. Or, what was the point of showing your cat if you weren't gonna like put it in a microwave or something like Mr. Plinkett does? <laughs> Jesus Christ! That's what Mr. Plinkett does. She, her reviews were inspired by Mr. Plinkett. She makes references to him all the time. So yeah. just yeah, have like a scene Chris where you. Really? Uh, She's inspired by Mr. Yeah, she, she has. Me, have, uh, a script joke. have a scene where you like put your cat in the oven or something. If you're gonna rip off Mr. Plinkett, you might as well do it accurately. Listen, if you're going to stick with the cat, you might as well give us a show. <laughs> the 
Hey, this is Jens. There's roller coaster. Danny's a jelly a boy. Hey, what did you do? Oh, man. Dead. Danny, are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? Are you okay, Danny? Alright, so some more, some more stupid stuff happens. Jenny? The, they rip off the end to Aladdin, like, like, really, really, like, really obviously. And then Danny gets the reality Infinity gauntlet. Infinity gauntlet. And then this happens. Dan? I... I'm sorry. We're very proud Snaps of you, his fingers. Oh, oh, my baby's uh, crying! Is you know, so good. But I lied to you, over and over, for a really long time. If I were you guys, I'd be furious. Well, of course you lied to us. We never gave you a reason not to. All this time we've been yammering on about destroying and dissecting ghosts? I'd have been terrified too if I were you. Hey, that's great! We oh, finally no, get a resolution no. to one of the most major conflicts in the show. Think of all the cool dynamics that can happen now that Danny and his family can work together. Man, this is gonna be great. Oh, me, well, he, he wiped their memories. No reason why, he just does it. Whatever. He, he could solve and, and all the world's problems the now. He has a gauntlet, like go go on the Doka and everything. But now no, yeah, he doesn't. He, he, he just he just changes everything back to the status quo. Whatever. Why I don't not, care. Roll credits. Because that would be selfish. I suppose it's. Unfortunately, the most powerful device in the universe. I Don't bought this garbage season for game. nothing. God damn it. She's a robot. Yeah, robot. Robot. Danny Phantom was a show. You might even it. say it was a escape. good show. Airing on Nickelodeon in 2004, Danny Phantom was a show about a boy with ghost powers oh, who had to fight. I found it. No, I had to fight. Personally, my most favorite video for nobody. It's actually just a collaboration she did that she doesn't even own. My favorite Robo Buddies. Oh yeah, that's right, that video. Witness. Planet 51, not Area 51, Planet 51. Fucking idiot. Yeah. Remember. Just, just for that, I'm gonna punish you by posting lots of Jenny Hentai. Uh... Fine, trap porn. Look at Mr. Incredible. That's not a punishment for him either. God damn it, you're right. <laughs> like, you see Mr. Incredible? You actually fucking like that. So you know what? I'm gonna post this gif, and it's post gonna shoot the, you. Post Mr. Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> the GameCube. <laughs> Rebel Dexy. <laughs> How dare you. You took my daughter. Oh, I, I, I don't mind being shot by that. Still lost in this. Come on, bring, bring up the ante. I am. Now you gotta deal with dead mean. Hmm? How do you feel about that, huh? I don't mind that mean. It's a good video. Twelve that... men of bank memes. Will Marvel break in one punch? What does that yes. even mean? <laughs> <laughs> Let's watch it. Let's see what he means. I don't want to. You think you could do it? We don't want to watch it. You think you can thread my mother? Cinematic parallels? Man, I still you think you threaten my mother? Go to hell. Shut up, Mocha! No one wants to hear your opinion. About Man of Steel. <laughs> yeah, we just won't watch Man of Steel. Shut up, man. Uh-oh. There. 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 We're Superman. Shut up, Mocha! Give her whiplash. Was that the real sound effect? There. Oh, hey, listen to it. That was. 
That was the real sound effect. From Half Life. Shut yeah, up, no cap. This is dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Pull up the casket for a second. Did you hear that yell? Where has he hidden it? Did you hear that yell? No. <laughs> I know. That's my favorite Superman moment. You think you could threaten my mother? When Superman flies General Zod through a crop field and blows up Smallville and all the farms on it, and he's repeatedly punching General Zod in the face. Uh, it's my favorite scene. He blows up the 7 Eleven, as Batman would put it. God! <laughs> there goes 7 Eleven. Punch General Zod through a 7-Eleven? 7-Eleven? Shut up, How Mocha! How did anyone take this movie seriously? You destroyed the slushy, Superman. You'll pay for that. What? Armin White gave it a good review. <laughs> You're right, he did. <laughs> so did Angry Joe. Oh yeah, Angry Joe liked it. Because <laughs> he punched Zod through a 7-Eleven gas station. <laughs> What's that thing? What? What have you done to me? Parents taught me to hone my senses, Zod. Don't tell him, dumbass. Focus. And just what I wanted to see. Without your Don't helmet, tell him! You're Why everything. are you telling him that? Because he's Man's super gonna do that. He's super he's amazing. Amazing. He's guy. Idiot. Noise he made. Ah! There's a bunch of CGI guys come in and carry him into the new spaceship. I thought they were arresting him for a second, like, is that the end of the movie? <laughs> have you not seen Man of Steel? It was quick. I have seen Man of Steel, I just, like, questioned it. No, I, I said I have seen it. Oh. Blade, oh my god, it's my favorite Blade moment, the fat thing. <laughs> Is that a CGI person? <laughs> fat vampire. My mother. The crap do you ride there? I think you threatened my mother. You already watched the fucking scene. <laughs> Is that an eagle? <laughs> Why? Is that an eagle? Yeah, what was that? <laughs> All three of us heard an eagle. See, the eagle is symbolic eagle. of how Superman, American is, Superman is. is is about truth, justice, justice in the American, in the American way. way. And that's his character, even though he renounces American citizenship. Yeah. No! I remember him. You're a fraud! God damn it. Spider Man! I bet you. Hey, let's pause it for a moment. So, a couple Skeks. weeks ago, I had a look back on this. I bet you I know why he made this video. Because he said at the end of the Sam Raimi one that he was gonna do it. Oh, I thought he made it because, like, people gave that video a lot of flack. So, he's just like, shit, I gotta, I gotta get my, um, emo yeah, back. Yeah, That too. It's probably That's... why he did it at the end. He knew he was going to get yeah. shit on. And I like how he cherry picks the comments because all of them were just saying, calmly saying he's wrong. And he cherry picked ones. There's infamous swoosh.
Yeah, Rhino's performance in that movie was really good. I like the scene at the beginning where he's going, he's driving down the street in his big truck, and he says, "I don't know what I that." That's my favorite scene in any Spider-Man. Where he screams. Yeah, he screams. Ah, at he goes, ah, ah. Yeah, I like. But uh, yeah, I like how he cherry picks the comments. Start. Almost no, cinematic it's... universe. All movies reviewed. You ripped me oh. off, you idiot. This is the guy that you ripped called off out. my idea. Ripped that I, I gotta come out on that shit. You ripped me off on an idea that I didn't even put into action yet. What's the same um, as Sam Raimi? Hey, Skek, I got an idea. Got an idea. Remember how you say you want to make a Batman retrospective? Uh, uh, did I, did I say that? that? Yeah, you said you wanted to do it on all the games, including I'm side might. scrollers. I might. And if you do that, um, I'm scrollers. thinking of doing a review on the Arkham games. Like, we could do, like, a video together on that shit. What yeah, do you think? Like a good old-fashioned collaboration, uh, like the top ten thing. Sonic characters. Hold on, let me pull that up real quick. Yeah, we gotta get top ten hottest Sonic characters, man. No, 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 no wait, it's this one. Top Let's five, get, what was it Are worst? you recording still, Mocha? No one's recording anything. We never were recording. You were just fucking with me? No. But you said you were recording. Oh, yeah, like this when video. When a new Sonic game comes, I, new characters. I think of it as, and let's face this it, is not whenever somebody mentions, like, a Sonic collaboration, I just think of this. Whoa, whoa, wait a second. This is... <laughs> what? That's how we gotta do it. That's how we gotta ah. fucking do it. This is an experiment. Like, this is genuinely, like, a... Like a psychological. Whoa, like, wait a minute. This is awkward. How, how do you find these videos? How the hell do you find these? Most of the time, I have a hard time believing that. The only video that I would see that would be in Skek's favorites playlist is that Samurai Jack fun song video. Because it's on the level of the SpongeBob Linkin Park songs. Actually, Skek, same you caliber. Need to do this. You need to make on, Skek, look that up. Look that up. Samurai Jack fun song. Look that up right now. Please. I'm gonna make this video on your channel. So we're you gonna go through all the playlists? Skek, give me the remote, please. Skek. Damn it. <laughs> Stefan. I just like that the fact that he. He deafened himself. Did you not hear me say that? Are you deaf? No, because I was ignoring you. That was Why were you ignoring me? The new Sonic Dex, game comes new characters. Now let's face it, not video. all the characters in the Sonic series should have been made in the oh, first Samurai uh, Jack but fun hey, song. Would... It's something that be... I think you would put in your favorites playlist. Fair and talk about no, the ones that I really I've stand out. It. And the ones that have terrible flaws to them. Uh, and yes, I said bad, we right? for a reason. Yeah. Hello! Whoa, whoa, wait a second. This is. Awkward. What? Mm, nothing, never mind. Not all characters can have their own theme song, but we want to give credit where credit is due. And fast to characters that so deserve epic. it. Just a heads up, I love how they do all their. There's Shadow Recolor. I love how you can't list, even hear it. We feel they earned their place <laughs> like on the radio, and but And we don't want the best list to just be filled with tails and knuckles. Do you mean you're hearing a radio from the street? And let's get this out there right now. Most of the characters on this list are based on whether or not we like it or not. Which is nothing short of a no duh. And chances are, you might not like the ones we do. So instead of complaining about our list, just make your own. Uh, CJ, how many times do people listen to you when you say that? Very few, it seems. Alright, let's start it off. Gamma was a pretty cool character in Sonic Adventure, right? It was like playing for the bad guys, then going rogue so the character was redeemed. Story Even though he was, was showing first. gameplay of Tails. Gamma was a pretty cool that? character in Sonic Adventure, right? It was like playing for the bad guys. See, he's playing his Tails. Bad guys, then going rogue there so the character right was redeemed. Its storyline was diverse, it was able to think on its own, and it had a gun attached to its hand. And even though its story was finished, they brought the guy back in Sonic Battle. Gamma was one of the best robots in the E100 series. And that was pretty clear as Gamma took down all the other E100 only like two. robots. But he 
wasn't the best. I am Omega, the ultimate E-Series robot. Now, some people out there are saying that Gamma should have taken this spot instead. Well, Gamma is to Omega as Scyther is to Scissor. Both are great, but the advanced one is just better. Omega's arms is a voice processor and has enough firepower to take down just about any. How many times have I seen this video? Gatlings and flamethrowers and missiles. Oh yeah! <laughs> the last of the E100 series had to be top yeah, of the line. What great I've mission did he video. get? Shoot Knuckles and take the Master Emerald? Lead an army of other E100 series robots to expand Eggman Land? Tickle Sonic until he gave up the Seven Chaos Emeralds? He got stuck Wait, what? Shadow while he was stuck <laughs> what was that last one? <laughs> Shoot Knuckles and take the Master the Emerald? Lose. Lead an army of other E100 That's series Sonic robots to expand Eggman Land? Tickle Sonic until he gave up the seven Chaos Emeralds? What? Why did he say that like Vector? When Omega was reactivated, he swore a bitch against Dr. Eggman and sounds like all of other robots. Ever since then, Omega has usually yeah, that's one vector. idea in mind. Destroy Eggman no, not him, the other guy. He was the best robot ever. And have been put this in a guy sounds like, like Duke Nukem because he's Omega played, did not deserve that timeout. Omega is strong, can hover, yeah, this guy and likes to use its allies as a parachute or fist to open Although the door. the gameplay they were showing was the broken Sadly, Sonic. Sadly, we haven't seen Omega in a while, but we can only hope to see it again. Also, he's voiced by Vic Mignogna, so you know there's that. And its first voice was John St. John, the voice of Duke yeah. Nukem. That was John, definitely a good fire. fit for the character. Uh, CJ, do you think we're cheating by having three characters Why is share Vector this spot? Talking? Hey, you can't have the Triforce <laughs> with two pieces, you can't have a Nintendo system without a Mario game, and you can't have Team Chaos without the Actually, sum of its, it's parts. Totally Vector, SB, and yeah, Charlie. There's... So while... Uh... Huh? I did it so I did it once. I got a DS and I never bought a Mario game. Well, it means it's been like Nintendo never releases one without at least one Mario game. That's what yeah, it is. You, you don't get it. You, get you don't even get it. You don't even understand our five favorite animated Sonic characters with Will Duke, E Duke, 83 Reaper, Crisis Sonic Heroes. 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 Crisis Sonic they were also the boring. only team in Bingo Highway that goes to the VIP board. <laughs> I know, it sucks. I'm guessing that's where they got all the money this to send back. This is uninteresting. We all... It's nice to see people get along. Oh, well, let's face it. We also like to see others get on each other's, each other's nerves. Why? Dark You're gonna I don't know. Maybe Dark it's because Returns. I can actually create humorous dialogue <laughs> gonna... for us to listen to. <laughs> yeah, gonna but it is great to see that despite their differences, they can join together to get the job done. As long as that job is <laughs> no, trying to be a new sensational singing group. I think it's time to start talking about each character individually. We'll start with Charmy B, the one that apparently everybody but me hates because I'm immune or something. Charmy is usually seen as the one making trouble in the group. But that's to be you expected to from a six-year-old that apparently door. has ADHD. He's actually oh, supposed to be the team's try. mascot, but would rather go canon? on a mission than the other dude instead of being the poster Good. boy. Plus, credit has to go to his incredible strength. He is a bee that is somehow drop. able to fly short distances a with a chameleon and a huge crocodile hanging I mean, from its leg. He's a pretty you see pit, this? Uh, big bee. Are you paying attention to this? Victor did because that's one of the reasons Remember, they haven't squashed him. Victor actually sees a lot of potential in Charmy. That and the fact that Charmy virtually has no fear means that he can grow up to be a great detective one day. And speaking of Victor, let's talk about Espio. Uh, whatever. Espio the Chameleon is the one character in the group that definitely sounds the coolest. The ninja. And being a chameleon, he's able to camouflage into his surroundings. Which is usually one of the traits that ninja wants to have. He is also a playable character in Song the Fires before being reintroduced with the Chaotix. While the other two seem to be clumsy, Espio appears to be the most to join this. and the most well-trained. Not to mention that he's also got this. shurikens that are bigger than him and he just this. seems to throw them without any problem. Jeez, how strong are these guys? They're strong, I wish all right, I, but they don't. I wish Espio would just cut off his own head with one of those things. They're huge. Compared to me. What? In been here for five minutes. No. Uh, sorry, I think I forgot to close the door. On my way <laughs> I know, but, right? Uh, Vector, how did you get here? That's not important. Oh my God, what it's is a real Vector. You've been neglecting me this whole time. Charmy and Espio are great and all, but I'm the real face of the chaotics. 
I'm the leader of the group and easily the strongest of the team. That's the why I'm the one who got to go to the Olympics. I was also the one who figured out that it was Dr. Eggman who hired us, while Espio and Charmy had no idea what was going on. Sure, I'm a bit money crazy, but overall, I'm a dependable crocodile who has a big heart and even big... I'm just going to talk about my, myself and all this vivid detail, just in case uh, nobody played that game. Bigger muscles! I can also breathe fire and spit out explosive bubblegum bubbles. Explosive bubblegum bubbles? What exactly have you been eating? I still want to know how you even got here. Yeah, fine, if you must know, I was looking for the- Don't say it, don't say it, don't say it, don't say it, don't say it! If you say the you-know-what room, I'm gonna lose my mind. Uh, I gotta get going, gotta finish the job! Crisis averted. Dignity intact. Ah, here's the computer! Next entry! <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna have to end the stream there. Why? They made the computer room joke. They made the joke about the computer room, and I didn't. was hurt. Is that a real Christian? Yeah, Christian said that, remember? They made the joke about the computer room. I was just saying the It's Venom. Not, huh? not oh, like damn it, I, tra damn, I transformed. <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> damn it, I transformed. I didn't even notice. I, didn't, I wasn't even paying well, attention. Now there's one thing. <laughs> Just blind. A quick I'd like one to thank you all for watching today's video. Oh, it doesn't hurt.